Phil Walters here with Anthony Hartwig after Gerard's big 3-2 win over Lakeview here tonight. Coach, that's a great way to open the season for you guys. Uh, absolutely. You know, uh, um, we had a good night last night. And, uh, you know, to come back from a two-set deficit, that, that, that's impressive for the girls. I told them take that away because that's probably the most important thing. Be able to play when you're down is, is huge. Like you said, they go down 2-0 to a Lakeview team that has been dominant for the last couple of years. What do you think it took to kind of come back from that? I, I tell you what, it's maturity. We, we, you know, we have some young kids, and I think once they grow and start learning how to play together, I, I think they're going to be, you know, even a lot stronger. And I think that's what it is. Is, is you know, we have a lot of youth right now. Even our, our primary hitters are, you know, still quasi young. And uh, once they get to a point where I think they learn to play with each other and just, you know, work with their abilities and just start believing in themselves, they're going to play good. I, if they can believe in themselves, that's the key right there. We have to talk about Lauren Pallone. Yes. 25 kills on the day. Uh, what, what's it like to be able to coach someone like that that can take over games like she can? Well, Warren's amazing. I, you know, I, 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 you know, I try not to give kids too much credit while while we're playing, but she, you know, with her. But she, she's just amazing. She's an amazing athlete. Uh, probably one of the top two kids I've had the opportunity to coach in my 20 plus years. Um, she is, you know, just a force to be reckoned with on the court, um, and her abilities speak for themselves. You know, and her stats also. This is a big win, but it's a whole season to go for you guys. How are you going to manage the not riding the mental high of beating Lakeview and taking care of the rest of the schedule? Uh, you know, I, I think I think in sports in general, you just take it a day at a time. You know, you never get too far ahead. We don't talk about tomorrow. We talk about tonight. You know, we talk about the next practice. There's always fundamentals to work on. There's always things that we need. You know, I'll tell you right now, we had a lot of unforced errors tonight that we need to correct. And, uh, you know, we go back to the drawing board every time, and I think it, it's just that getting in their heads that, you know, we can be better. You can always be better. You might win by a few points, but you can win by a few more the next time. Everyone got to see the reaction of the team after this win. Can you put into words what this kind of means for the morale of the team? Because obviously everyone knows Lakeview's been the dominant team in the league. You beat them in the first game. It's got to mean a lot to the team. Oh, absolutely. And I think that's, the, you know, we just had the stigma of them being, you know, beating us for the last few years. And just to come out and play them strong. I mean, they're always tough. Always, for as long as we play them, they've always given us a great match. Um, I, I think the kids, you know, it, it speaks for itself. They were just so excited to win, um, especially when you lose to a team that much. Coach, before we let you go, what are some of your overall goals for the rest of the season? Oh, man, I, I tell you, I got one goal, and it's just cleaning up the uh, unforced errors. I always say. You know, I appreciate the sport more than I do the wins. And I, I just want to see us play clean volleyball. I want to see us, you know, clean up what we can clean up and just to play hard, aggressive volleyball. Keep the ball on the court and, and you know, don't cut our own throats, you know. Good. Thank you so much for taking the time after your win. Uh, celebrate this one for a little bit and then get yes. back on the horse. Uh, we'll see you again real soon this year. All right. Thanks.